Hello and welcome to another Wizard Wentz will watch you a video. In this video, I'm going to be showing off a one card sprite combo to ably lock your opponent. And then I'm going to be showing off two different variations to turn that one card combo into a two card combo that's going to net you even more advantage. So, to start our one card combo, all you need is sprite starter. So you activate starter, you special the blue from deck, activate blue effect, you add the jet to hand. You then special summon the jet, and then you add Sprite Smashers to hand. You then go overlay for a gigantic sprite, and you're going to activate gigantic sprite. So detach for effect, summoning out the Nightmare Corruptor Ibli. So if you're not familiar with Ibli, uh, when it's used for a link summon, it, you can summon it to your opponent's field, and the controller of the card cannot special summon. It can except for a link summon. So, we're gonna link to, and do a sprite L. Then we're gonna use Ibli effect, summon it to our opponent's field. The beautiful part about this, you might think, oh, Ibli's a dark. They're just gonna bestial it away before you get summoned to your opponent's field. But we activate gigantic sprite effect, so they are unable to summon a bestial to banish the Corruptor Ibli. Because it can only summon, both players can only summon level, link, or rank twos for the rest of the turn. So we summon the ability to our opponent's field. Then we're going to use Sprite Elf. We're going to bring back Gigantic Sprite because they control monster. Set the Smashers, pass turn. And this, whatever they normal summon, to try and make a link two to get rid of the Ibli. We're just going to Smashers, banish the starter, and then banish their normal summon and the Gigantic Sprite. So that's a one card combo, so let's get into one of the two card combo. All right, so getting into two card combo, it's a swap frog plus starter. So you're gonna start out, normal summon the swap frog, and then elect to send a frog from deck to grave. So you're gonna send another swap frog. Then you're gonna activate starter. So you can do the same similar thing. Blue grabs jet, jet grabs smashers. You overlay into gigantic and you gigantic effect. Just summon out the Ibli. You then link into elf, summon the Ibli to your opponent's field. You, the only difference here is you elf effect, target the swap frog, and then you overlay into a totally awesome. So set the smashers, you get the same similar setup as before, except you put a negate on board. So the other two card combo I'm gonna show you, uh, I've been playing Sprite as Adventure Sprite. I like the extra negate that the Wandering Riffer Rider puts up on your board, as well as the way that the links let you just have to use at least one level two monster so you can use the Adventure Token plus anything to get into like an Elf or Sprint. So same sort of combo. You're gonna activate Rite of Armas here, summon the token, activate the Fateful Venture from deck. You're then gonna activate the starter, starter effect, summon the blue. You're gonna go chain one blue, chain two faithful. So you're gonna add the Jericho back, add the jet, jet effect to special, adding yourself the smashers. You're then gonna go faithful effect to add, adding the Griffin Rider, then sending the Draco back. Draco back effect to equip. And then you're gonna overlay into Gigantic Sprite. So very similar to the previous two combos I showed you. You're gonna Gigantic effect. Summon out the Ibli. And then you're gonna link into the Elf. So you can go Ibli effect, summon your opponent's field. So the reason we didn't summon the Griffin at all is because we were locked to level twos with Sprite Starter. So what you can do is you summon it on your opponent's standby phase, and then you have the negate up for their turn. There's very few things other than like Forbidden Droplets that they'd be able to play before you get a chance to summon the Griffin Rider. The other option you have with this combo is you can go Elf Effect, bring back Gigantic. And you can link to into an IP mask arena. So you set the smashers, you pass turn. 
they play their turn. If they have a way to link away the Ibli, what you can do is whatever they link it away to, let's say they have a Lingaribo, so they link away for the Lingaribo, then you can go, let's say, Chain 1 Smashers, banish the starter for cost. You can go Chain 2 Sprite Elf, Chain 3 IP Masquerade, or sorry, Chain 2 IP Masquerade and Chain 3 Sprite Elf. So you can go Elf, bring back the Ibli, you can go IP Mascarena into something like a Sprint. And then with your Smashers, you can banish their Lingribo and the Elf, for example. Then you're able to summon back the Ibli to their field because you linked it away again with the IP Mascarena. So those are just a couple combos you can do with Sprite. Uh, I can put at the end of the video the Adventure Sprite list that I'm using right now. So you can see just with those one or two card combos how you can fill the rest of it with either board breakers, hand traps, or other extenders to get an, easy, or an even crazier board. So that's all I have for today. If you don't already, uh, subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in the next video.